great shot. Steve Button was having a look. Pollock seems convinced. Eventually the finger does go up. Perhaps hit him outside the line, but let's not forget he wasn't playing a stroke. Hart maybe was a factor. Gone for not. Was it hitting? That's the big question to ask you. Finds the outside edge. It's a short boundary down to third man. That's picked up to full and a little bit too straight from Sean Pollock. It's a boundary again. He's picked it up. Superb stroke. This could be another boundary. That is raced off the bat. He goes again. There's a man behind square. Fine leg has come up. He's gone again. We've seen him today be very good on the short ball. This is the maximum, the first six of the match. Pulls convincingly. We've seen a few of his teammates, particularly in the test series. This time it's a pull, but it's more over but on. Smash that away again. Four more. Smashed away. I think Gibbs might have just got a fingertip to it, but it's gone for four. 50 up for Ibram Nazir. 9.50 and uh, has got a hundred as well driven down the ground it'll be four more and Justin Kemp gives up the chase almost as he started it a little oh he's run this down to third man have taken a second slip out and it's four more it's in the air it's high it's huge it's on the roof and it's coming down now yeah, very straight. There's no doubt about this. It's up there, gone. Absolutely dead. And Imran Nazir has gone for 57. Mohamed Yusuf. Beautiful shot. Runs away for four. Oh, so nearly ricocheting back onto the stumps. Sweetly driven and through. That is gorgeous placement and exquisite timing. And it goes all the way for four. It was no more than a push into the gap. Uh, Impish stroke just uh, lifting it over the inner ring to the onside. Prince is quick, but not quick enough. Another Pakistani boundary. Driven for four. Overpitched. And Yunus Khan is growing in stature. He's got it fine. And find a third man. Smashed away, and he goes on to 50. His 26.50, the second against South Africa, to go along with 200s in this format of the game. A great deal of problem finding. That smash, that really has been hit magnificently over mid wicket. Clinically put away. There we go. He tried it the previous ball. And on this occasion, pulls it off beautifully for the maximum. Uh, Yunus Khan seeing that straight away. Waited for it nicely. Hit through the line. Beautiful shot. Ah! Optimistic. Probably outside the line. In 271. Australia versus South Africa in 2001 and 2. It's gone for the big one. And pulled it off. That's the longest boundary. Great shot. Smith dragging it down. All the time in the world. No problem putting that away. That's it! Goes for the maximum down the ground. There is the deep mid on. And taken. One for 93, two or four for three, Pakistan. The captain of Pakistan with an incredible record. Down the wicket, in the air, off the ground. That is massive. The opposition here with this mighty strike. Appeal from Smith for the catch, appeal from Boucher for the stumping. Long stride in, was the back leg fixed behind the popping crease, it was. Big appeal for LBW. Denied by Brian Gerling. That ball would have gone on to miss the middle stump by a long way. Wants the one and will get it to get him to a half century. 
What a prolific performer he is. 52nd, 50, a sixth against South Africa. Pleasing innings from Ahmed Yusuf. Ball of Pollock's spell. And it will go for four. Too short and wide. And then Zaman really was quick on his feet to cover the width. Nasty. Inzamam's come too far up, but he's gone! Oh, my word! Well, there was never a single here. Inzamam was looking at the ball and just dashed. Incredible piece of running. He departs for 13. Pakistan 4 down, 2-2-2. Two, two, two. There he is, Boom Boom Afridi. The strike rate is always the impressive thing here. Edged away down to third man for four. But he's got away with it. But just as easily gone straight up in the air as it is, he's got four. Oh, he's hit that. He's hit that really hard. Flat for six. Afridi, bang. Chipped over mid-wicket. Beautiful timing, it's gone for four. Over mid-off, one bounce four. It's pulled away. More runs. No full toss. Nearly hits the cameraman, the still cameraman down there. Um, uh, not a bad delivery in terms of uh, 43rd over. Four more runs, I think, get added to the total. That's sweet, sweet timing. Four, beautiful. I'll use the word this time. Edged it. That was a genuine edge, just wide about you. The 3 deep. See what I mean? It's the wrong length. It's the wrong length for him. I'll tell you what, it wasn't off the middle. Uh, such a powerful man. Straight. Six more. Yeah. Really flat too. Bowling it on a length. And I tell you what, bowl it on a length at the death with uh, wickets in hand. That's what happens. Four more. Got it again. That MCC coaching book. That takes him to 50 in just 20 deliveries. He's third against South Africa. Over fine leg. He's a tall man there too, saving one, but it's gone for four more. High in the air, long off's under it, but it's over his head. <laughs> oh, he's hit that for 45. It's in the road. Absolutely smacks it. Doesn't hold back one iota. And the ball that shouldn't have been bowled. That's his 1,200 and his first against South Africa. And it's been a pleasure to watch it. Absolute pleasure. Quality cricket from Mohamed Yusuf. 110 deliveries, 12 fours. He's done it. Well bowled. Very well bowled. It's only the eighth time that 350 has been passed in South Africa during an ODI anywhere in the country. And it's been uh, down to a superlative innings. They're off the mark, a straight drive. And Graham Smith ensures that. Guys have catch it and down it goes. A life to A.B. de Villiers. It hits him quite hard. Mm. It wasn't like he's absolutely blitzed it to him. It's just, well, just quite simple. It's going to put third man number pressure here and it's a boundary to de Villiers. Feels and the question has been asked. Mohamed Asif finally turns to Steve Bucknell. Put this to nip back, it's nipped back, and it's just clipped the pad outside the line anyway. Taken a success to Pakistan, Hamid Asif going across Graham Smith. But yeah, 
It's straight into the reliable hands. It's a 38 for one. Sevilius <laughs> pulls that away. We've learned all evening. That's a big appeal for LVW. Umpire unmoved. First delivery from Razak. Yes, height clearly would have been a problem there. Oh, big appeal. That's close. That's close. Or is it going down leg? Going down leg, says umpire Bucknell. He's pretty uh, dramatic with his appealing. Height. Left it. He did it a little bit. It was a slower delivery, but Cullis went through with a shot and he gets four for it. Short. Pulled away. It's going to be caught. That Abdul Razak was looking for. South Africa, 87 for two. Down the wicket, over the top, and is it going all the way? We will have to wait and see. Yes, the hands go up. It's close. He's got him. Mercy for struck. Gibbs goes. South Africa lose their third, 110 for three. Yes, it's the back leg. See his hand immediately going to his leg, and that's why. There's a call for a quick behind, and gradually uh, obliges the big wickets of Callis. 113 for four. Cries a catch it and take it, and his first delivery back in South Africa. It's worked. This wicket has got to be credited to Yunus Khan's brilliance in the slip cotton. Once again, taking this brilliantly. Fully stretched. One for two, 123 for five. Ah! He's bowled a brilliant change of pace from Shai He's already becoming the man of the match yet. The big wicket of Mark Boucher. South Africa slump further, 147 for six now. Sean Pollock comes to the crease. Sweetly driven by Pollock. Whipped away this time through the onside. Oh, he's hit that a long way. Another one in a row. Yeah! <laughs> Caught and bowled. A tentative push from Kent, but maybe. Sean Pollock, but he just got that one up a little bit more above the aisle line. It just dropped on Justin Kemp. Played too soon. South Africa in deeper trouble. 179 for seven. Oh, they go up for the catch. He's got him. Shahid Afridi strikes again. This evening, Andre Nell trying to rip that on the leg side, getting an inside edge. Good catch by Akmal. He's 190 for eight. He's hit that one well. Launched it away over deep extra cover and away for four. Quick up. The edge is found. A little speed for four. Back-to-back -back boundaries for Antini. Down the ground, is it going all the way? No, it's not, it'll be taken, gone. Kai and Tini goes for nine. Oh, Peel for the stumping, and that could be it. It's a wide down the leg side, but Pollock is overbalanced, trying to help it on its way. Changing feet, can't get back in time. The ball is off, and that's out. Last man out for 32 or 34 balls. South Africa all out for 210 and victory to Pakistan by a massive 141 runs, redeeming themselves immeasurably. It is the second biggest win by Pakistan over South Africa.